more vintage speakers for you. Last time I did the uh, RCA UZ1375, maybe. Up there. This time we have an RCA. Oh, I gotta get the model number on this one. I don't remember. This one's 1935. This one's cool. It's housed in a little case. The back folds open. And this was made for projector units. It would accompany the projector unit. And as you can see, it's got a cool deco like design on the front of it with the, uh, the RCA logo right on the front. It's backwards, I know. MacBook camera. But, and also, the cool thing about this, as all of them, is they work. I'm going to try. It is 3.21 in the morning. Hopefully this won't feed back, but you can, you can hear it. Oh, oh, there it goes. Yeah, but you can hear it. It's pretty cool. Oh, new microphone. Electro Voice 664. With an on and off switch. So now let me play a little guitar through it. It's very clean. I can't remember the, uh, or I don't know what kind of speaker's in it. I think it's some sort of old Celestian. It's not original, but it's very... It's very clean. got a nice little hum to it, but I, I rigged it with an AC plug from a fan, so I know it doesn't sound safe, but it's really a nice little speaker. What I think I'm going to do is take the chassis out of this champ here, because it's only about this big, and there's a spot down in here that I can mount the chassis from this and encase it all in this, because this has got the uh, the handle and then the back of it. You know, so all in one speaker, I think that would be pretty cool. That'll be a project for winter break, way far down the road. But that's all for now. <laughs>